Tracks can now be grouped with just a few clicks of the mouse, given the option of clip position, comps and takes being locked and edited in sync. Add to this the possibility of linking volume, mute, solo, pan, record, colour, visibility and send parameters and you're starting to see the potential of Waveform 10's new grouping feature. In this tutorial we'll take a look at creating and managing groups while exploring ways to simplify and speed up your workflow. There are two ways to create a group. The first way is to select two or more tracks within your edit. This can be achieved by simply holding the command key and clicking on the tracks you wish to include or by clicking and holding shift to include a range of sequential tracks. Once you have multiple tracks selected, simply right click and choose Create Edit Mix Group with selected tracks. You'll notice a coloured circle is now placed on the tracks we just grouped. To view and edit the group, we'll need to first open up the Properties panel. Here we can name, colour and select the parameters we wish to link. The alternative way of creating a group requires Waveform's browser, so let's open that up by pressing the B key on the keyboard. Once open, navigate to and click on the new Groups panel tab. You'll notice at the bottom of the panel there's a large button labelled Create New Group. Click on this and a new group is created. Unlike the first method, we haven't selected any tracks to be a part of the group yet, so let's take care of that. Double clicking on the newly created group brings up a floating window with the same options we saw in the Properties panel. The most important thing to do at this stage is to add some tracks. This is quickly achieved by checking the tracks we wish to include from those listed in this black area. Now we've added some tracks, I'll give this group a name and close the edit panel. With the Groups panel still open, we can now see both of the groups listed. Notice how the colour of each group in the panel matches that of the group indicator circles on the tracks. This makes it quick and easy to identify groups in larger edits. If we click on a group indicator, the associated group in the panel is highlighted. Again, this allows us to quickly find groups when making adjustments. Let's double click on a group and take a look at the Edit Mix Group panel. We've already looked at naming, colouring and grouping, so let's explore what's left. Below the colour swatch we have an Enable button, which allows us to quickly enable or disable the Edit Group properties. This can also be achieved by clicking the Disable button in the Groups panel. Edit Groups are all about linking parameters. And here we have the option of linking editing, volume, mute, record, colour, visibility, pan, solo, send and track height parameters. When checked, any adjustment made on the track will be mirrored across the entire group. See what happens when we move, resize, adjust volume, colour, and adjust track height. Each track in the edit group responds in sync. These parameters can be linked when creating a group and modified at a later stage. We can also add or remove tracks to or from an existing group with a simple click. Finally, groups can be deleted by clicking the red delete button in the edit group panel. Alternatively, you can highlight a group in the Groups panel and press the Delete key on your keyboard. The creative and practical applications of edit groups are endless. Here are just a few examples on how to utilise them. Edit groups can be used to quickly record enable multiple tracks. This simple grouping can be a huge time saver when multi-tracking drums. Comps taken from tracks in a group will edit together, so you can keep your vocal takes in sync and your drums in phase. How about using edit groups to quickly solo or mute large sections of an edit? Edit groups can also be used to simplify the Groove Doctor editing process. Capture, analysis and editing is all made easier by utilising edit groups. 
Track snapshots can be applied to an entire group, making it quick and easy to recall previous states. Go ahead, experiment, and see how edit groups can speed up your workflow. Thanks for watching.